Keeping venomous reptiles is an unforgiving hobby, requiring proper training and lots of experience. One simple mistake can be the difference between life and death. death, death. Remember, the most venomous snake in the world oh, is the whoa. one that just bit you. There are no venomous snakes with training wheels. Just because you see Viper Keeper handle snakes a certain way does not mean you should try it too. Hmm. This uh, is a ringed water cobra. It used to be Bollingeria angulata. I'm going to run into trouble. Okay, um, is now reclassified as Naya annulata. Sorry folks, she's just going one end of the stick to the other and I'm trying to hold the camera and talk uh, at the same time and uh, she's making it rather difficult. There we go. At any rate, it's Naja or Naya annulata. And these are very, very beautiful snakes from equatorial Africa. Come on, focus you bloody thing. And these guys are actually very, very laid back. Uh, the problem with this girl is uh, she, she is always looking for food. No, 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 not again. Not again. Come on, sweetheart, stay in one place. You know, it's not that I have a problem... Uh, <laughs> Uh, controlling her because she's uh, wacky or something you know she's she's quite laid back it's just that she's looking for something to eat oh hello okay well I've changed the water dish in the cage subsequently I'm going to put her back and she's expecting food At least I think she's a she the male resides under a water dish and I very seldom see him. I think I'm going to uh, pull him out and give him his own rather nice tub. Uh, that way he can eat without her trying to uh, eat him. So, Naya annulata. Uh, I have them, but I rarely take them out because they're they're a handful. Not that they're exceedingly uh, uh, defensive or anything like that. It's just that uh, has a feeding response that's just unbelievable. Oh, now she's going to sit still. Okay. Now I I recently saw a. Uh, a document from the Department of Defense, actually, the folks at uh, uh, USAMRID in Maryland. Uh, they tested uh, South African polyvalent against the venom of a couple species of water cobra, including this one, and it works uh, very well uh, against Naya annulata. Works less well against Christii, but still effective. Uh, they couldn't get a hold of any Stormzy eye uh, venom in order to uh, to test it, but that was the results. Well, now she's uh, sort of relaxed, and I think and she's pointing in the right direction. So I'm just going to point her back into her cage. There you go. Now since she's in the way back, I can move around. Hello? Oh, we're hooding. Hello? Hi. We very rarely see you hood. Hello? 
Very, very rarely see them hood. I brought you some water. Oh, look at that. That's nice, huh? Forget the water. I want the food. Thank you. She is a food hound. Hi, baby. You're good. You're good. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, now you're talking, buddy. Now you're talking. Hello. Okay. Ah, you can hear the horses fighting in the background. Now, in this cage somewhere, probably under here, we have our friendly neighborhood male water cobra. You want something to eat, huh? Who happens to be very, very shy? Come on, bud. the uh, other sibling of that monster that I showed you earlier in the video hasn't really been a good feeder but feeds much better yeah come on have something to eat feeds much better when uh, when he or she is alone and boy it yeah. yeah that's a yummy yummy mouse you haven't eaten in months Don't be shy. Come on. You can do it. I know you can. I know you can. Yeah. Okay, let's try the open the dead mouse's mouth trick. I lift the roof on your house, huh? Yeah. Ooh, little hood. Let me see. Are you hooding at me, huh? Come on. Come on. These are the gentlest of the African cobras. Yeah, come on. Yeah. They seldom uh, give you any trouble except, you know, a very vigorous feeding response and and this guy is not the best feeder on the planet. Here. Oh. Maybe you like a little wetter, huh? 
Oh no, you just want to be left alone. Yeah. I'm sorry, that's not in my agreement uh, to leave you alone. Let's pull the tongue way out. <laughs> you want to do it yourself? Now, oh, come on. You don't want to want to play rough. You don't want to play rough. You just want you to get you get you eaten again, and uh, you know, get you your own quarters. This way, that mean old big snake doesn't bother you, huh? Oh, come on. I know you're interested. I can tell in your posture. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Hey. Yeah. Right now, the behavior says nothing that it's not interested. Hmm. Oh dear, dear, dear. What do we do? Come on. Oh, don't give me that hooding stuff. Oh dear, oh dear. Come here. I know. I know. You're such a you're such a wacky snake, huh? Go on. Let's be gentle. There we go. Come on, we got the big forces. Come on. Oh, that's a good guy. Yeah, I think it was more, it was like, oh, is that a finger? I'll bite that finger. Come on. Let go of me, I'll bite your finger. Oh. Yeah. You bit it once. Come on, it's dead. You killed it. Okay. Well, rather than force feed it, I'm just going to leave these two mousettes in the cage come on you gonna tuck under there huh? come on under there come on come on yes I don't I don't treat these like I would uh, a red spitter or certainly a forest cobra as I said uh, these are every one that I've seen has been relatively laid back and gentle so we'll uh, we'll put it back in a dark room and and uh, we'll see if it uh, eats by the time nighttime rolls around <laughs> you sneaky bitch you nice try she was drinking calmly for a second and then decided I was close enough to take a swing at. Okay. For a small snake, she sure gives you a workout. Meanwhile, Silver Bullet looks on and says, is there anything in this for me?
this is a snake that you can't possibly take your eyes off of because she'll bite you if you do. And she's sort of coming out of shed. So I want to make sure that she gets a nice drink of water. Otherwise I, I would just put a water dish in there and let her fend for herself. But I think you guys know me pretty well by now. I like to ensure that the animal's going to be okay and has enough water. Okay, game on. Water break over. Oh, uh, come on, you're going to lose your water. You're going to lose the water. All the nice water I gave you. It's going to come out your nose and your mouth. I know. You are just, just a biatch. There you go. Come on, have a drink. You need it. You're shedding. It's that time of the month. Ah, easy. Easy. Oh man, she's going to be something when she can see clearly. I can see clearly now.